Most of our military helicopters were not attack helicopters but utility helicopters designed for the transport of troops, military equipments, wounded soldiers, and even the delivery of relief goods to far-flung areas during calamities. Our Philippine Air Force has acquired many of our helicopter assets, for naval warfare in the Philippine Navy, and incoming helicopters for the Philippine Army in the future where most could possibly be dedicated for transport. The McDonnell Douglas MG 520 Defender Attack Helicopters of the Philippine Air Force, is a light multi-role military helicopter based on the MD-500 light utility helicopter. The Air Force acquired 25 units of these helicopters and was used to support troops during encounters with the New People's Army and lawless elements like the Abu Sayyaf group for the past few years. The Augusta Westland AW109AH is a four-blade aircraft with two turboshaft engines and retractable tricycle landing gear. Its secured radio communication system, electronic optical-slash-infrared sensor, flight director, weather radar, IFR equipment, and precision weapons capabilities provide day and night lethal fire support to surface forces with less collateral damage. The PAFAW109s are used as armed gunships while both armed and unarmed AW-109s are operated by the Philippine Navy. During the Battle of Marawai, multiple PAFAW-109s engaged in combat the ISIS-affiliated MOT group. In early November 2020, a PAFAW-109 was involved in a joint operation of armed forces of the Philippines Joint Task Force JTF, Sulu against Abu Sayyaf kidnappers in northern Mindanao firing upon a boat in conjunction with strafing fire from Philippine Navy, multipurpose assault craft. AW-159 Wildcat is a dedicated anti-submarine warfare, ASW, and anti-surface capabilities. The Philippines need ASW capabilities in countries regions where other nations have growing operations of submarines. On May 7, 2019, the Philippine Navy took delivery of the two AW-159 anti-submarine helicopters. The Philippine Air Force's Bell AH-1 Cobra is a single-engined attack helicopter developed and manufactured by the American rotorcraft manufacturer Bell Helicopter. The Jordanian government has provided two units for the Philippine Air Force. An Antonov AN-124 airlifter carried the two Bell AH-1's Cobras from Jordan to Clark International Airport slash Clark Air Base. The order for Turkish Aerospace Industries, TI, T-129 ATAK attack helicopter has been approved and the delivery of the first two units of T-129 tactical reconnaissance and attack helicopters, ATAK, are expected to be delivered in September 2021, it is a twin engine tandem seat, multi-role, all-weather attack helicopter based on the Augusta A129 Man USTA platform, the helicopter is designed for advanced attack and reconnaissance missions in hot and high environments and rough geography in both day and night conditions. The procurement of a total of six units is part of a deal worth nearly $269.4 million. The remaining four units could be delivered also in batches of two in February next year and in February 2023.